Hey, my Leos. Welcome, welcome, welcome to your general reading for today. This reading is going to be from August 2nd all the way until August the 8th, okay, through the Lion Gates portal. So this reading is basically just to see what's going to happen during this Lion Gates portal for my Leos because I love you guys and I'm married to Leo, so, you know, I thought it was pretty cool. But <laughs> I'm going to do other signs this week also, but I wanted to go do the Leos first. So let's go ahead and tap into your reading, guys. Welcome, welcome back if you're new to my channel. And if you're not, welcome back. <laughs> We're going to go ahead and get into what is going on with the Leos. August 2nd through the 8th spirit. August 2nd through the 8th, the collective of the Leos. August 2nd through the 8th. Leos. I'm hearing determination, stay determined, don't lose sight of your vision, your focus, esteem for my Leos. Don't lose sight of your vision. You might be going through some changes, Leos, um, but these seem like good changes that they just want you to not lose sight of your vision. So the first card that came out was ground your light, let your soul shine. Ooh, that's beautiful, guys, for um, the Leo Collective. But this um, Lion Gates portal, I, mean, I am feeling like um, Spirit is definitely should saying that some of you guys are going to be receiving some recognition. I don't know why I'm feeling that. Um, because they're saying stay true to your vision. So you're going to be receiving some recognition, Leos, um, with this portal. Look, timing is critical. Celestial Gatekeeper. Timing is critical. So Spirit is saying, don't um, be so worried about how things is going to happen, when it's going to happen, okay? This bird is so mystical. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. I love the way this bird looks. You guys look this way to people. Some of you guys are influencers or will be starting to become influencers. And I'm just getting all of this intuitively. I am feeling like you guys are going to receive some kind of recognition for all of your hard work in this portal or after this portal. It's going to open up. You're going to realize how much you have accomplished and have completed during this portal. And um, also, Spirit is definitely encouraging you all who are not into grounding your light to please start spending more time out in nature and grounding your light because it's going to help you. Like when you're grounded, so many positive things can come through, Leos. So you definitely want to make sure that you're grounding your light and staying positive. I'm also seeing that you will be seeing a whole lot of birds during this time period and that y'all just to be a guide. So what I'm seeing is they're going to be guiding you. You're going to see them, and when you do see them, know that everything is going to be okay. Look, love and light, act with care. So, Leos, this energy is going to bring a lot of intense energy. Spirit don't want you guys to lose your top or your hang handle or um, what you're going through, the changes that's happening, because I am seeing that you might be tested, and not in really a negative way, but things are changing around for you guys doing this time and in order for us to get to where things are more light and bright and more weightless you have to go through the bs first okay but i don't really feel like that for you guys leo it's like what i'm feeling is like this energy seems so loving and welcoming from your spirit guys they really just want you to embrace and accept this i can't lie some of you guys y'all will be going through certain changes that isn't fun or fair but not everyone and generally i think the energy is just more calm more relaxed more preparing you for what you ask for for the manifestation of all of your hard work okay so i love that for you guys we all i want to see what changes are coming through and let me tell you guys i wasn't prepared i just felt like i needed to get out here and do these readings and then i got here and realized i haven't put none of my decks out so sorry <laughs> sorry if you can hear that sorry 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 my leos i don't mean to ruin your time or to like take up too much of your time but i want to get some changes that's coming in for the collective of leos and you know this is general reading guys so take what resonates if you don't that is resonating to you you don't have to leave a negative comment which is exit and find a reader who do fit you because it's so many out here you definitely don't want to spread negativity guys um especially right now so let's get some more what is the changes that's coming through the leos during this time all the way up until the line gate portal 
hope y'all feeling this cozy vibe i didn't turn on my ring light today because i just wanted it to be a little bit more of a cozy vibe for my meals okay oh divine masculine mm. let's get some more spirit love messages and solar plexus chakra okay so this is very specific for my Leos, okay? So some of you guys are going to be meeting your divine masculine. I feel like that a lot of my feminine Leos have been trying to attract love into their life, um, have done the work and ready to find that person that matches you, that completes you, that brings you into this um, energy of feeling more light and you know not kind of where you don't have to feel like the masculine you know you want to feel more like the feminine and with this solar crisis energy i'm feeling a lot of power a lot of confidence coming through this reading with you leos you guys are embracing it so i am hearing that um if you want to incite this or excite this energy with solar plexus energy so please wear yellow throughout this time guys um when you wear it wear it with intention I'm hearing the angel number 322, so that might resonate with some of you guys, but definitely grounding your light. What, the, what I'm noticing also with this divine masculine energy is that I feel like there is going to be some communication with some guys or some of you guys who um, have been in a separation with the divine masculine i'm seeing this as throat chakra energy up in here so just be aware that if you have been manifesting somebody coming back you might just get that done <laughs> this portal guys that's actually pretty cool hold on one more change is coming in for the leo collective but if not then i am feeling like some of you guys are just going to be in a divine masculine energy just getting shit done okay these two cards fell and we have consciousness so lee look at what i'm talking about guys leos y'all are really going to be really doing amazing and then we have the dynamic card that came out and then like the dynamic card just talks about harmonizing between layers and aspects of different things so like i was saying you're going to be you're going through these changes guys you're going through these changes during this period spirit really wants you to ground yourself and stay with the energy of love and light some of y'all might be really feeling really fiery temperamental um anger bitter any of those things maybe even shadow energy coming up because one thing i do notice guys is that when you are lifting and you're raising your raising your consciousness and you're growing trust me spirit well not really spirit but there will be energies that is going to be working against you they're going to be like literally sent to try to throw you off path and off track and you don't want to do that like don't let these lower vibrational energies stop you from progressing and getting where you need to get to Leo. that's what i'm saying i keep you know as i'm channeling y'all gonna get used to it i stumbled over my words a lot but this is trying me trying to get everything out <laughs> but i really want y'all to understand that everything is going to be okay like you don't have to worry about um pretty much anything and we have gaia so this is why spirit really wants you to connect and ground yourself um guys it's because of like you are connected to earth they want you to stay connected to earth receive the blessings from actually being grounded in connection with earth and you just don't want to lose that vibe okay spirit is saying stay grounded guys consciousness is coming through while you're getting these upgrades you want to stay grounded it's kind of like plugging your phone into the wall um plug in your phone into a socket because you need that power okay you need that upgrade of energy and that's what's going on here okay so let's go ahead and get into the tarot for leos so i want to see what's going to be happening for my leos i'm sorry i'm all over the place guys i don't really feeling like some of you are really going to be feeling this chaotic energy that i'm feeling this morning um i'm pretty much in a calm state so i feel like you guys is gonna be like zen like okay you're gonna be feeling real calm and relaxed during this period not really um too much going on and even if you do feel like somebody's trying to ruffle your feathers you're not even gonna let it happen so let's get some general energy for the leos the collective of the leos Ooh, we got the king of swords okay guys and then the king of wands all right, so I'm seeing this two ways, okay, you guys know it's general. Um, Spirit is saying that for the collective of my women 
who are feeling, you know, have been calling in their divine masculine. I do see this King of Swords coming in with some communication for you, a different perspective. Maybe this is a separation you've been through, but excuse me, this person seems to be coming in with a clear mind, seems to be like more focused than they were before. So that might even make you guys more excited because they listened and they took your advice. What I'm also hearing for my masculine leos my masculine is you're showing up as the king of wands guys that's so dope <laughs> regardless if you are female or male but if you call yourself and resonate with the divine masculine energy of the king of wands you are feeling in your creative like power you're feeling masculine strong very wise very much so in that big d energy okay so <laughs> the ladies may be feeling that this week they're gonna feel that they're gonna see that they're gonna be like oh my god look at so and so he's just glowing with this energy i'm just so in love with this energy let's get some more for the conscious <laughs> conscious for the collective guys y'all gonna get used to this spirit is used to it y'all gonna have to get used to it strength in reverse okay spirit is showing that the strength of okay so i am seeing that you guys are really going through a battle, okay, during this time. You're really going through a battle, and the strength is showing up in reverse because I am also feeling like there is going to be um, someone who's going to come through. And honestly, I don't even feel like this is somebody in the physical. I do feel like you guys are going to be receiving help and assistance from a spirit guide. Um, for some of you guys, the spirit guide will be new, and for others, the spirit guide is a spirit guide that has been with you for a while, a while but this person is coming through and they kind of seem like they're gifting you while you're feeling at your lowest at your worst so again guys not everyone is going to feel like this but some of you are going to feel like very trapped in this cycle as if things are changing around you don't know who you are but i'm seeing the strength card is here to say that you are stronger than you appear to be and that you should give yourself more credit during this time because you're growing you're growing okay i really am seeing that like with the leo collective like you guys are growing into this big strong energy um through this lion gate portal what message you have for leo spirit okay so things are becoming more clear with this hang one in work i do see some enlightenment on a decision you guys were trying to make i am definitely seeing that um the messages you have for the collective leo okay look the chariot card came out guys just know that whatever you've been worried about it's not going to come out or turn out the way that you expected this portal has really some heightened intensified <laughs> energy coming through and you guys are learning to take more balance in life take the sugar with the shit is what i just heard excuse my french but i'm hearing that taking the sugar with the shit knowing that in order to manifest what you want look i'm also seeing that you're letting some people go you recently let some people go and this is manifesting some great things into your life during this line, line gate portal there was people around you who constantly kept shit going okay these people constantly count drama and negativity around you maybe even you know you might have had some falling out with these people in the past but what i'm saying is that you are getting rid of this energy um and i'm seeing that you guys are really you know like standing in your power now you guys are showing up as the king of swords and the king of wands and as i'm seeing you're feeling more like your ideas are coming to life you're feeling like you can manifest anything you want by just thinking about it like and honestly that is true okay that is true i want more for the collective leos thank you spirit more for the collective leo collective leo collective oh look at the seven of wands here i mean seven of wands the seven of cups Use your imagination, guys. Look what came out at the bottom of the deck, the justice card. Use your imagination for sure. Whatever you want to manifest is coming. You guys. Oh my God. <laughs> I love this reading. 
I'm really feeling like you guys are soon to be gifted for all of your hard work, okay? And then in the same time of you guys being gifted, I definitely see you guys also blessing others. Because, you know, you know how y'all Leos are. Y'all so very, very sweet in your heart. Y'all just don't like to be fooled with. It ain't nothing wrong with that. It's nothing wrong with that. You guys are very sweet. And it's nothing wrong with helping out, assisting others, being there for others, um, showing your love and uh, attention and affection and appreciation for others and i really i really really love that for you guys for the leo collective okay so let's let's see what's coming in the very okay so what is leo's leaving behind what are my leo's leaving behind this portal what is my leo's leaving behind spirit and my leo's leaving behind. okay we got this page of pentacles in reverse energy and that's what they're leaving behind some of y'all are leaving broken family dynamics. I'm seeing um, like broken family dynamics. People who were really like controlling, people who were young-minded, people who were um, who didn't best have the best interest for you on heart. I'm seeing that you're gonna be leaving these people alone. You're gonna be realizing, also, Leos, that maybe even the people that you were really close with really is it like you know how like they say blood is thicker than water but you kind of realize that that's not true you're kind of realizing throughout this time also leo's that maybe there's some people you have to leave in behind that you love a whole lot but they're blocking your progress they're not helping you they're not they're not really like good people and you're going to be aligning with your soul tribe people who are going to want to actually support you is what i'm seeing with this ten of pentacles here people want to support you you're creating your own family in here some of y'all might be creating your own family or that's the goal yeah like spirit is saying that with this four swords in reverse, it's definitely showing that there's you come you guys coming out of a resting period, maybe even a period where you've been like just stressed out and worried about things. But it seems more like a resting period, guys. Um you you letting go, okay? It's like there's things that you was holding on so tight to, maybe like the outcome of something, or maybe even like I said, friends and family members, but you're letting it go. And you're like, you know, I'm not gonna allow you guys to block my blessings, my manifestations, my clear sight in touch with spirit. Because it's kept you in this nine of pentacles in reverse energy where you just haven't been seeing anything manifest, okay? You just haven't been seeing anything manifest. And you like, you know, or maybe even when things manifested, you manifested it and you went to go share your good news with people. And they just was like hell bent on trying to like block your blessings, trying to block your success or just not being approving, approving. But here you are showing up as the magician, okay? You can manifest and you can take control of this and do whatever you want. You have all the tools that you need, Leos. Spirit Guys has been trying to tell you that, honestly, for a long time because you haven't been making any moves or... You haven't been in there. Maybe you've just been a little bit more anxious about what's been going on. I am feeling like you're going to come out of that energy, okay? Like, you're going to come out of this energy. Because it's some things like you have been trying to manifest that maybe haven't came through yet. Look at what's at the bottom of the deck. You're going to be leaving some shit behind, definitely. But um, this two of wands is just showing me like, there's some things that you was trying to manifest or something like that. But um, it's like you need you needed a solid plan. Spirit says you needed a solid plan. So, guys, definitely if there's something that you want right now, um, all the way up into the line gates portal, I would highly suggest you put in some plans into action. Let's get some um, star seed oracle messages for the Leo Collective. Y'all haven't used this deck in a while. <laughs> Ooh, look what came out, guys. So we have the impact they start see, okay? Absorbing what's not yours. Okay, so that goes back to what I was talking about. Well, whoever this person is or these people in your life, they kind of have you in this energy absorbing what's not yours. Or maybe even they've been purposely sending you negative energy, Leo. We have portals, see? So now with this portal, we already are aware that the doors are open and you decide wild cards. So spirit is saying you decide. Some of you guys have been actually wanting this change, but that means that it has to come with a sacrifice. And you guys like, do you know what I mean? I really have to sacrifice? Yes, baby. Yes. Because you have a double mission here. Like work with star seed, serve the world by being you. So spirit really wants you to open up. And look, 
cracked open rock bottom surrender to the alchemy of life there's some changes that's really going on that's why i was telling you guys that um i could see like some of you guys are really going to be going through major changes and it may not feel good because you're going to be going through this cracked open energy and having to surrender um having to surrender to the alchemy of life the changes that's going on i'm not trying to control the outcome because you are on a different a double mission so you're realizing now throughout this time for those who are just probably starting to come through the awakening how gifted you are how you are here to live a different life and there's a lot of things about your foundations that's changing because you're finally starting to come into that energy accepting who you are okay accepting who you are so, guys, I want to get some love messages for um, the Collective of Leos before we get out of this. And I need to find my other deck. Oh, here it is. I was like, where's my cards? So let's use these decks really quick. I'm going to get three cards for the Collective of Love for Leo before we close out this reading. So, oh, okay. Ooh, we have the Stepper in the corner, so that's the Queen of Pentacles. Love for the guys. Love for the guys. My car is going too far on the floor. Okay. We have the Ten of Swords. Oh, Spirit said you definitely picked that up and flipped it around. I'm sorry. <laughs> And then with the chariot, so guys, what I am seeing is there's a new opportunity coming into your love life. So you, with this ten of swords in reverse, you guys are definitely overcoming and healing. But I am seeing that some fast energy coming in. Like so, some of you guys, I'm literally going to be meeting the love of your life throughout this time. I'm hearing right after the portal. Um, still in the month of August for a lot of you, but the charity chariot energy is definitely showing that this is coming in quick. This is a more I'm I'm definitely feeling like the divine spirit your ancestors have all to do with this coming in. Like they definitely orchestrated this out for the type perfect time period because they knew that you needed this. Okay, like your team is the shit, guys. Like they really, really, really love you guys and they really want to see the best for you. So I'm loving that. I want to get um, some general love messages. What change is coming in for the Collective of Leo? Change. What change is coming in for the Collective of Leo? Realization. See, guys? So there is a... There is... There is okay, so I'm hearing two things. Some of you guys as Leos are realizing that you need to be going after someone special. And then others, you actually going to be receiving that recognition from someone else that they miss you, they love you, they're coming back, they're going to change. But a lot of you are going through an upgrade or realizing something in your love life that's going to change your love life. Maybe just the pain that you've been through and maybe that there is somebody special that is, is in your life that you truly love. But I'm feeling like there's going to be a big upgrade. And then we have the Cosmic Flower that came out. See, it costs... So, I got a... I cannot talk. A lot of you guys are going to realize that there's somebody in your life that you call home with this cosmic flower. They feel like a flower to you. This is somebody you love, somebody you care about, um, a, a person, a passion, someone that you actually love. I'm also hearing like too. Some of y'all just also may be a fire sign. But um, this person feels like home to you. This person feels like, you know, warm energy. And some of you guys are, have been in separation with this person. So Spirit is saying, keep an open mind, okay? Don't shut this person out just because of what happened. Look at the Ten of Coins, see? They're saying, don't. This person is going to bring you that stability you desire, guys. Stability is coming into your love life, okay? With this Ten of Coins here, we are completely aware that it's, this energy is coming through for a purpose okay and then we have the emperor card here like this person um is definitely gonna be embracing the best of themselves throughout this time higher self you um higher yourselves <laughs> leos <laughs> you want to tap into your higher self um and like allow this energy to come through okay i want to get some more oracle messages before we close out i'm so sorry guys that i'm all over the place i'm really not sure why my wording is so messed up like today but honestly i'm feeling like spirit is giving me a lot of exciting energy so that's that definitely could be it
let's get some love messages for Leo's. You guys, I have to fall in love with my crazy talk <laughs> um, because that's just how it is. Sacred Union, look, guys, honor and treasure your relationship, boys. Truly sacred. So, guys, a lot of you guys are going to be realizing that this person in your life, like maybe you had people who were sending you negative energy, trying to distract you guys on your path or your love life, and you're realizing that. You got to cut these people off because they don't want the best for you in your romantic life. Soulmate. Your soulmate is already with you in spirit. Believe this and they will manifest physically. So, guys, um, remember I was talking about this um, King of Swords energy and I was saying that you guys can picture something and manifest it. This is what I'm talking about. Um, all you have to do is try to manifest this energy. Put the work in. And they say a message for you. I'm thinking of you this very moment. Your love fills me with light. I love you. Guys, someone loves you dearly. And if this is you, definitely take that time to reach out to this person. You don't want to miss out on life. Life is a learning experience. You get to learn. You want to learn. You don't want to miss out and get back to the spirit realm and trying to contact me through your friends and family talking about how you wish that you would have just taken it more seriously and enjoy life a little bit more because that's all i noticed with doing mediumship readings is you know pass on loved ones just like i wish i would have you know taken this time to do this and that but of course while we had the 3d it's so much harder so guys because you guys are the lion y'all have that fierce leo energy definitely stay on top of you know being your best self don't let anybody you know try to take away your confidence um just work and be happy don't you know be in your path with ego and miss out on opportunities okay so a couple more messages i'm gonna get for the leos before we wrap this reading up love messages for leos okay look and i love to see leos happy y'all so like in your inner child energy is so beautiful and this is like all leo energy um i'm hearing aries so some of y'all might be connected to aries look higher power so i told you guys are receiving downloads you guys are receiving help and yang that's that divine masculine energy okay so it's powerful strong energy you guys are in the energy of making stuff happen okay and if not, just trust and believe for my feminist, your divine masculine is coming. The higher, higher power is working behind this. And they want they want you to be happy. You're going to be extremely happy. So, last messages we're going to get. Um, the self-care oracle. And see what self-care uh, messages do still have for the collective of Leo's. So can messages for the collective field of spirit. So can messages for the collective of videos. Do you have for the Leos for self care? Mm -hmm. Okay, we're gonna take these ones. We have massage. So, guys, um, definitely this would be a perfect time to pay for a massage or get a massage. Um, if you have someone in your life, you can make it real romantical <laughs> and ask for a massage from this person. We have hydrate. So, spirit really wants you to drink water as you ground yourself. Guys, that water really helps you with storing energy, keeping the energy pure. But water is really great with manifesting. So, also I'm hearing like maybe trying to manifest with water and burning bowl rituals. So, letting go. Some of you guys, they want you to do like daily rituals where you can let go and release. And, you know, as you see, like she's sitting there with... Um, to say to let go and she's gonna burn it you know in the fire to release this energy and as you guys are fire signs that actually might work out perfectly for you guys okay so leos 
I hope that you guys enjoyed your reading. I really hope that I was able to clarify what's about to happen during this Lord Gate, Lion Gate portal. That you got the messages you need. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe. If you're not, don't forget to hit the like button. And to tell me what you thought about this reading and how it applies to your life. Because there's some positive energies coming in. And I'm definitely excited for you, Leos, okay? Okay, mother loves you so, so much. Take care of yourself. Mwah.